Okay. Can you just hear me clearly? Yes. Good job. Okay. Well, how are you and what did you do today? I'm fine and... Uh... Yes, go on. What is that? You're I'm fine. Good. You're good. Okay. <laughs> and what did you do again? <clears throat> Mm hmm What did you do? Yeah, I? Did you just stay at home or did you go somewhere? Did I just stay at home? Oh, you don't have a class today at school? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. That's good. Okay, and tell me about the weather in your place today. How was it? Was it good? Uh, no, it's good. Really? How good? Is it sunny or what? Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, is it sunny? Yes, it, uh, no, I think it's not because it's, it's rainy today. Oh, I see. It's rainy. Actually, in our place, um, it's sunny, but partly cloudy. Yes, it rains a little bit, but not heavily. Okay, in your place, is it rainy heavily? Or rainy heavily? I think. It's healthy. I think it's healthy mm. because the, it has storm in it. Oh yeah, do you have experienced storm? I think it's stormy. Ah uh, yes, I see. Okay, maybe that's why you just stayed at home, right? You didn't go out today. Correct. Correct. Okay. Well, anyway, um, let's continue to study your book. Thank you so much for your information. Okay, let me share your book with you first. Let me know if you see it. Okay. Okay, I can see it here. Okay. So yesterday we had talked about um, this one about... How many friends should you have? Okay, that is what we learned last, uh, yeah, yesterday. So let's try to read the comments here. Okay, and after reading the comments from the website, you have to make a decision if you agree with it or you disagree with the opinion. Okay, you have to tell me if you disagree or agree with the opinion. Okay, let's start first. Um, please read. This one, I, I would, would never accept an online friends. I who did, who I, know, who I didn't already know. Uh -huh. You, how can you, you? How can you be friends with someone you've never met? Okay, that's from Sylvia from UK. Okay, so that's right. okay, you agree with it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Why do you say so? Why do you agree in that sentence? Because I don't like to be friends with uh, people I don't know who. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's correct. Mm -hmm. Who would um who would you know who would be uh friends with someone you would or you don't know, right? It's you know, it's really um, dangerous also, especially if it's online, right? Right. Yes. Okay. So um, have you ever tried having friends online or never? I never tried friends online. Mm -hmm. You have never tried. Okay. And that's good. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And yeah, because um, it's really not, you know, um, a good thing, especially if you don't know the person, because, you know, nowadays there are a lot of dangerous things that is happening in our 
um, environment, right? Right. So we just need to be careful with it, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. And another one, another um, comment, uh, please read, I'm reading this. Mm -hmm. Please oh. read. I'm reading in this at work, at my lunch break, and I want to comment about the fact that most companies won't let you go on Facebook while you are at work, even in your own time. I don't think it's fair because there's a main way I communicate with my friends. John, you can. Okay. Correct. Okay, so you would agree with this one. You don't disagree. I disagree. You disagree? I agree. Uh-huh. Yeah, you agree or disagree? Which one? Agree with uh. John. Okay, you agree with John? Okay, because um, I'll have to clarify, okay? If you understand the, um, the opinion or the comment, she, I mean, he said that um, during his lunch break, he wanted to uh, use his Facebook. Yeah, because, you know, when you are in your lunch break, you can have your own time with that, right? It's time for you to rest, to have a break, and, you know, um, not think about work, right? Or let's say um, when you study, right? When you study, you have a lunch break. Yes, I study. I have a lunch break. Okay. Yes. Do you study when you're having a lunch break? No, I not study because I eat. Ah, uh, okay. That's correct. So this is what it means here. Um, it's just that the situation is different because it's at work. They're talking about, or he's talking about at work. Yes. And um, he also said that I don't think it's fair because this is the main way I communicate with my friends. Do you also use phone at school? I don't use uh, my school. Not use phone. Mm. Okay. You don't use your phone at school and that's good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because I thought you are, you know... um using it but not okay so he said that um it's just the only time he can communicate with his friends during lunch break yeah so is it okay to use facebook on lunch break um. yeah yeah uh, is it okay to use a facebook um during lunch break? No. No. Okay, why is that? I don't know. Uh-huh, again. Uh, why do you think that Facebook, I mean, using Facebook during lunch break is not okay? Yes. Facebook, uh, now I can have. Uh... Mm -hmm. Go on, go on. I'm just listening. Uh, I, I don't use uh, Facebook when I launch in my lunch break. Okay. In my lunch break, I only eat lunch. Okay, and um, for example, I talk, uh, I talk to you with your friends. Oh, yeah, I understand that it's because um, you have a close friend in or at school, right? Yes, yes, and I'm a student, cannot use Facebook, correct? That's exactly right. But in his case, he's a worker, he's an employee, 
Yes. So um, in his um, in his situation, he wanted to use Facebook during lunch time. Yeah, because this is his only way to communicate with his friends. Okay. So you agree with that? Mm -hmm. Am I correct? Or do you disagree with it? Mm, you agree? Oh. Yes. Okay. Next one, number, or the next exercise, or the comment, please read. I think, uh, please read. Mm -hmm. I think people who are I'm sorry, I can't hear you clearly. Can you repeat? Okay. Yes, please say it. I think who have hundreds of friends online must just be really self um sees and looking for attention. Mm. Okay, that is from Roy. Uh, Roy from Portugal. Okay. Uh, do you understand this one? I understand this. Mm. And do you agree with it? I think I agree with it. Yes. Okay, why? Why do you agree with this sentence? Because uh, who needs to pay, pay attention needs a uh, lot of friends to pay attention. Okay. When, uh, that means that if you have lots of friends, mm -hmm, um, you also need, it means that you have, your, you need more attention. Yeah? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And also, yes, do you think having a lot of friends online um makes you what I, how do I say it? Um how do I say it? Um uh, um makes you say that you are making more attention to other people. Yes, making more attention when having many friends. Let's say here it says hundreds of friends online. Does it mean that you are looking for more attention? Yes, they need more uh, they need friends for more attention. Okay. So you mean to say you agree with that? Yes, is that correct? That you agree with that sentence? Mm -hmm. I think I agree with that sentence. Okay. Yes. So I guess um we have different opinions. And yeah, I also understand and you know respect your opinion. <laughs> okay, because we have different one. Okay. Now, I would have to also ask you, how many friends do you think is the right number to have? In your own opinion, how many? Yeah, how many friends do you think is the right number to have? I think uh, four to five best friends is... Mm -hmm. Go on. Number to have. Uh huh. Is the number or is the right? Is the right number to have? Is that what you mean? Yes. Okay. Okay. Why? Why do you think so? That you just need just that number. Like only um five at least five friends why why is that
Mm -hmm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Again, okay. You said that only five, okay. At least five close friends. <coughs> sorry, or best friends. <coughs> Why? Why do you say so? Because we have some one is not best friend. Hmm. We have some that you feel like you are not close to them. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see. Yeah, because, you know, when you have a lot of best, or you're not saying best friend, when you have a lot of friends, yeah, when you have a lot of friends, um, that means that you're a friendly person, right? Yes, I'm a friendly person. Yeah, if you have a lot of friends, yeah, that means that you're good in making friends, okay, something like that. All right. And now... Mm -hmm. Let's go for um, learning about the grammar. So that's the present simple and the present continuous. Okay, let's look at first at the active grammar from one to five and match the example sentences with the rules in A to E. Okay, we're going to match the rules in A to E. Okay. Okay. Look, okay, look at first the active grammar here. Can you see that? Yes. I can see that. Okay. Now, okay, first one, I'll read the first one. People with better social skills do better in the workplace. Number two. Okay, number one, the high Latin word is do. Okay. It's the present simple. Using the present simple. Okay, how about number two? Please read first. Okay, wait. I have more than five, uh, 700. Mm. Facebook friends. Okay. 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 So the underlined word or the highlighted is have. Is it present simple or present continuous? It is present simple. That's correct. It's just present simple. Okay. And next one. I'll read it. I'm studying as well as working. So the highlighted word is studying. Is that a present simple or present continuous? Uh, wait. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's present continuous. Present continuous? Okay, correct. Yes. Okay, because we're using ing there. Okay, next one. I see them once a week. What is uh, the verb there? I see. Uh huh. See. Okay. Is it present or present simple or continuous? I think it's continuous. Mm hmm. Continuous. Oh wait. It's Number simple. four. Okay, it's just simple, present simple. And number five, I'm reading this at work. Okay, what do you think is that? Okay, which one is the mm, present simple and the present continuous? The present, uh, present continuous have ing, and the present simple did, didn't have <coughs> ing. <clears throat> Sorry, yes, correct, that's right. Okay, so reading, okay, is present continuous okay now we already know the active grammar so we use the present simple for okay this one present simple example for present simples sorry present simple habits routines what sentence is it is it one two three four five habits and routines do you know what is habits and routines? 
I don't know. Mm. When you say habits and routines, these are the things that you do um, every day. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. What do you think is your answer there? In <clears throat> letter A, habit and routines, that is what number? Sentence number one, two, three, four, or five. Sentence. Uh, and it's sentence one. Sentence one. People with better social skills do better in the workplace. Um, does it fall to habits? <coughs> mm -hmm. uh, I think it's not, right? Yeah. So let's have number two. Look at number two. I have more than 700 Facebook friends. Does it fall to habits and routines? No, right? Right. Okay. So that is number four. I see them once a week. Okay. Or yeah, I see them once a week. I have more than friends or people with better social skills do better in the workplace. <coughs> mm hmm Okay. Okay. Again, I would just like to emphasize what is um, what is the action verbs and the state verbs and both. So when you say action verbs, these are the things that you can do, right? It is. It has actions. State verbs, like it's just in your mind. Okay. State verbs. Okay. This one is habit. So this is an action word. So that is number one. Okay, you're correct. Next, number or letter B. Things that are always true or permanent. True and permanent. So that falls to state verbs. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. Things that are always true and permanent well true what number i think all the way true is uh, remember that's present true. simple present simple okay you find oh. the present simple i think it's the number 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 five number five um, I'm reading this at work. Is it present simple? Is number five present simple? Look at number five. The word is reading. Is it present simple? Yes. Number mm -hmm. five is present simple. Are Two. you sure? Look, it says I'm reading. Reading. Okay. Mm -hmm. That is not a present simple. This is a present continuous. So the choices for present simple are only one, two, and four. Okay, one, two, and four only. So what do you think is your answer there? Oh, always true and always true and four. Mm -hmm. True and permanent. That is is I think two. Two. Okay. Next one is describing a state. Describing. Mm -hmm. Describing a thing. Describing a thing. Or a state, yeah. Sentence. Uh, 
is on this one. Number one. One? One oh, is I letter A. Number two. Two? Two is letter B. Number two. Number, number four. Okay, four. I see them once a week. Okay, now let's go for present continuous. Okay, so we have there things that are happening now at this precise moment. So it um, the choices there is number three and number five. Okay, things that are happening now at the precise moment, like um, the things that are really, you know, happening right now. Mm -hmm. Three or five? Number five. Number Letter D. Okay, what's your answer? Things that are happening now at this oh, precise moment. Three or five? Five. Five. I'm reading this at work. Yes. Okay. That's correct. And letter E, temporary situations that are happening around now. Mm. Temporary, only temporary situations that are happening around now. What is it? Mm. Only temporary situations. Yes, what is that? It's it's number three. Three. Okay, correct. Yes. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yes. All right. Now do you understand the use of present continuous and present simple in a sentence? Yeah, do you understand the use of it? Or do you have any questions? If you don't understand, mm -hmm. any questions? Yes. Do you have any questions about the lesson today? No, I don't have any questions about today. Okay, good. All right. Anyway, I guess um, it's almost time. Yes. So let's just continue everything in our next class, okay? Okay. Okay. Thank you and see you again. Bye-bye.